Hi, and welcome to my channel. This is KB. We're saving 101, and I am KB, Kim Baker. If this is your first time visiting my channel, then welcome. I'm a lifetime thrifter turned reseller. I currently sell on Poshmark Macari Tradesy, diving into some others, along with sending boxes into ThreadUp that I did. So if you are interested in reseller tips and tricks and lots of haul videos, then do me a favor and please hit that like and subscribe button down below because it could really help me out. All right, so today is Third Up Tuesday. Um, I'm giving you an update on things that are happening and some of my reclaims that have come in. So um, along with some tips. Anyway, we're going to dive in. Um, let's see. So the last video I did, I told you that I had a Calvin Klein um, pair of pants that were sold. Um, well, right now it says return initiated. So I'm up by getting them back, which is fine. I'll make more than $10 <laughs> if I sell them myself. Um, next, I did get my payout for my uh, David Bitten Buffalo yeah, pair of jeans. Um, so I received a $31.54 payout. Um, I did have two sales. Um, I have a Ann Taylor cocktail dress that I will receive a payment in like three days um, of $31.49. It was not returned. And also, um, I sold a BCBG Max Azaria skirt. That payout would be $49.69. The only bummer of it is it looks like it probably was a goodie box poll, which we all know what that means. Most likely a return. So <laughs> there you go. There's the sales updates. Um, I still have one box that has not been checked in. It's been there since October. It is the old pricing. All of my items are old pricing, guys. Um, I do drop the prices, just so you know. Um, and we're going to dive into my returns. I've got two boxes. I'm going to give you some tips on what I've been doing lately. Um, all right. So what I do prior, I know I'm reclaiming these items. They're in my cart, right? Um, last time I gave you the tips on, you know, holding your cart over for a longer period of time and continue shopping or adding to your little bundle thing by doing that bundle deal. So, um, Yes, and don't forget if you have extra points and you want to buy something, then do that. But um, anyway, um, I go through, I've said, I showed this on my Instagram. I actually start doing my screenshots of my items before they arrive so that I can start editing those photos so that I am prepared to start listing them when they get in. And then I print off in color. Don't ask me why. You don't have to do it in color if you don't want to, but I do it in color so that way I can find the item right away, check it off, make sure it is what it is and that there's no damage or whatnot. Um, and then I'm listing that entire box that I received and I'm going to just close her up and keep it in there. There's only like a few items, which I totally forgot. I need to pull those. They're right over there, though, um, because I'm not, of course, sticking my shoes or my purses into this box. This isn't just going to be my clothing box, but I'm just going to label it T-U-A, <laughs> and I'm going to be done with it. Um, you know, my inventory system usually consists of Ziploc bags inside big, huge 27-gallon tubs, but I am trying to play catch-up, so this is how I try to do, cut my time. All right, so there you go. Um, let's get into what I received back. All right. So these are, da, 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 da. um, they are, who are you? They are J Crew made in Italy and they are leather, I believe. Yes. They have the little symbol. Um, and they're this gold, I don't know. What do you call that? No. Oh. It's not trefoil. Um, they're little flats. Uh, what size are they? Size seven. So um, there's a little bit of um, wear to them on the tops, just a tiny bit, but they're really super cute. So get them up, get them listed. Um, I didn't get those listed, but I've almost got this entire box here done. So this happens to be 
um, a coach, and it is the Kirsten Drawstring Leather Bag, and um, it is in a navy. If it's not showing up navy, it's blue. And you can always, like if it looks too black, if you look on the interior, it's blue. Guess what? It's going to be a blue. It's not going to be a black. Um, it's a really super cute bag in really good shape. Um, it's been listed. There's just a little bit. Of, I don't know if you can see that tiny little bit of wear. That's, that's really it. Um, but anyway, it's been listed in my closet before. Um, and I just went through. Um, when I send items in, I will put them as not for sale. When they finally come back to me, I will put them for sale. And then I do my copy. And I copy my particular um, listing on Poshmark and make sure that um, I update it a little bit and then relist it and delete the old. So it's a new listing. There you go. And I also cross posted and like I got a message right away from Macari, but I'm a little leery of Macari um, because I did pay more than a dollar for that item. <laughs> so, I don't know. They do have their own authentication, which was $5, but I didn't want to pay for that. Um, all right, so I have listed these. These are Charles by Charles David. They are a 10 medium, and they are this, I mean, and platforms are supposed to be in. So they're a platform, cork, espadrille, wedge, sandal, ankle strap. I don't know. Lots of detail there, but those are up and listed. Okay. Oh, and this item, um, I told you I picked up an item to sell. This is the item I chose. Um, I've been selling a lot of faux fur coat or vests, so um, this was free to me. It was. It's an almost famous extra large, um, and it is this faux fur tunic knit back, open knit back vest. So, um, yes, it already has some likes on Macari, and it was just listed yesterday. So, all right. These are a page maturity size 33. Page is a highly expensive brand. I think these were originally $209. But, yep. These are cabbie jeans, a size 2. This little crop pant. Ta -da! By the way, everything is for sale, and this box is already listed. My next box isn't. All right, I haven't listed this one. I haven't decided what I'm going to do. Um, there is some damage on it. That's what comes with playing with thread up, right? Um, so this is Chico's. It is a size two. It is this gorgeous. It's 100% silk. Um, it would be perfect mother of the bride. Um, it's got pleated scoop neck, sleeveless. Um, swing or shift dress uh, all the way to the floor. It is a maxi, but it has come back to me with holes right there. There's two. There's one and there's one. I don't know if you can see this other one. They're not major, so I might still go through and list it. I don't know. My favorite style of dress. I don't know how that color will do. I mean, maybe I should try them for my daughter's wedding. Ah, anyway. Onward, let's see. This is an Ann Taylor Loft size 10. Um, it is this blazer and it is colorless, which is like the new trend, even though this is more of a vintage like piece. And I want to say it's linen, and I'm pretty sure it's linen, but anyway, here you go. Has um, so it is colorless and it's a scoop with little latches, some detail on buttons on the sleeve. All right, next is Ann Taylor Factory Signature, size 14. And they are these gray dress pants and they are straight leg. This one is so super cute. Maybe I should try this on. I didn't try it on yet, but it is adorable. It is a cabbie. It is a size extra small. That's probably why I didn't try it on, but I think it's supposed to be like oversized and it's like this tunic. I mean, 
some of the photos of um, the stock photos, which is great. Cabby does have a lot of stock photos, so you can always take punch in that number. If you don't find it, you can do images. Um, you can do uh, Google Lens um, on items, uh, just so you can see if there's anything else out there listed like it. Um, I, I have been doing a lot more research. Before, I would just list items, and I really didn't care if there was stock photos or whatnot, but I have upgraded my closet until, I don't know, I get in trouble. So <laughs> anyway, this is a Mac Studio size M, uh, M, size M, size medium, getting a little whippy, aren't I? Elastic waist, this is a Rothella size 10, 60% um, wool blazer and a houndstooth and it's green on green. I think that's actually cute. This is Guest by Los Angeles, or Guest Los Angeles Extra Large. They had it listed as Guest Jeans, of course, but I was not going to correct them. I'm just done. Um, and it is um, this, uh, like, bodycon uh, cocktail dress. This one is super cute. This is an Allison Joy. And what size are you, Allison? Somewhere. I think it's a large. And it is sleeveless scoop neck, um, ruched center, and an animal print. Ah, uh, that's something I would ever pick up, right, guys? <laughs> All right. This happens to be Pitt Amsterdam. And, um, New with tags, and I believe it's linen. I don't have any material content, but it is like um, I put um, tribal because uh, I think it definitely has like a tribal vibe to it. Um, winged sleeves because it's like actually kind of come up in the air on the mannequin, and a scoop neck um, swing dress. These are Joe's jeans, and they are the Muse Fit. And the Nico wash. It's a really dark wash. So yes, they have a, um, a they're like a boot cut, but they have what they call the whiskering, which is like the lighter um, faded detailings to it. Um, and they really don't have any wear except very minor, which I noted. Okay, this is super cool. I cannot believe it did not sell whatsoever. Um, this is a Chico's a size two, um, and it is this, look at this. It looks like a faux leather reptile print, um, short sleeved sheath dress. So, um, with leather being such a trend, I really think what hurt it, um, cause it really should have sold, I think for the season, um, is that they really don't have that kind of description to it. I just noticed something. I, I am. I will have to note and send it back because I believe when I sent it in, but it did have the belt. I'll have to go back because this, I think it was sent in twice. Oh Lord. Okay. This is Escape size six and it is a formal satin maxi full skirt um yeah. purple beautiful color this one is so cute this is a tahari it is an extra small it is a brown leather three button single breasted notched collared with pockets trench in like a duster length so super adorable all right there is that box. I have one more box, guys. Excuse me, one second. I told him not to call me. <laughs> All right, so in this box, uh, this has not been listed yet, so there you go. This is an Ann Taylor Factory Curvy Size 6 pair of um, pants. Oh, they're very... These, these feel wonderful. I'm telling you, these are like, um, 
nice, beautiful lounge, almost like an athletic feel to them um, with zipper pockets. Okay, I'm afraid my stack is gonna fall over. All right, this is a Charango. It is a four petite, and it is this super cute black zip up, I don't know, safari, military style, collared mini dress. So um, with uh, roll tab sleeves, um, and do we have, well, we have these pockets with that zipper, exposed zipper detailing. This one's adorable. And it is a CNM Chelsea and Violet, size medium, and this like space die print, little swing dress again with some lace detailing, uh, long sleeve, uh, balloon long sleeves because it's got the little elastic. All right, this one is super cute. Can't, I'm telling you, I just don't, like, this must be my super cute box, maybe. <laughs> All right, this is, I'm telling you, I sent in everything. This, one, this one's Aster, size medium. This is super cute. It's okay, it'll, be, it'll get listed and sell for uh, spring here. Uh, just this, you know, lace detailed, again, a uh, little swing dress with um, that back detailing and um, front lace now, there you go. Next, this is a Talbot's Pure Merino Wool, a size large sweater and an animal print. Yeah, scoop neck. Well, actually more. Uh, not really. But you guys could, I, I'm like, yeah, I guess that is a scoop because it's not quite as small for a crew. I don't know. Those, when it gets that small, I go, which one do I put it under? All right, these were purchased and returned. So uh, this is Michael, Michael Kors, extra large. And they are this pair of pants, um, almost like a legging style, super stretch. Um, I think these will still do well, even though they're kind of more of, I would fall colors, but brown is supposed to, I don't know. I heard somebody just say brown was gonna be a good color this year. And I'm just like, not all year. I don't know. I've never seen brown like as a, the color of the year. But um, yellow is actually our, yellow is one of them. Let's see, Lucky Brand, extra large. And it has a zip up hoodie in this print with pockets, with pockets. <laughs> All right, I am gonna fall over, so I'm gonna come back here. Uh, these are uh, Lucky Brand, size four. And do we have any other wonderful details on you? Not that I can see. There again, a pair of jeans with some whiskering. And they're a little stretch. Uh, does it have a flare? A little bit of a flare. There we go, minor. All right. Who are you? Banana Republic stretch, size six, like pencil skirt. Gosh, and you feel like your wool of some sort. Wool blend, possibly. Yes, wool blend, 93% wool. There you go. And it's stretch. Little pencil skirt, back zipper entry, and um, back zip, or back, uh, what do you call it? Um, slit. Sorry, there's some dust. This happens to be, um, who are you, who are you? Who are you? Um, collections for La Suit, size 18. It is this kind of cute, I think it's called a trumpet. Ugh. Guys, and you can see it has this black, like pleated detailing down the bottom. And that's why I say it's like a trumpet, but I'll have to Google some more. All right, surprise, this one did not sell. This is a Calvin Klein. It is a gray and it has a ton of, all of this is zipper detailing. That is really super cool. Um, and it is a size 14, so quite bummed. 
but my sales like totally tanked, totally tanked for a very long time there. So I don't know. This is a Laura Clement um, collection and it is a size 14. And again, it is a wool um, blazer, coat, jacket, and a, okay, now I'm, herringbone, herringbone. You can see it, herringbone. <laughs> Sometimes I start doing this and I'm like, Gosh, I act like an idiot because I can't remember nothing. <laughs> Maybe it's my nervous jitterness. All right, these are blank NYC size, I think it says 28. Uh, Do they say anything else? Like a whole speech on them? Blah, 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 blah. Anyway, they are again a pair of jeans. Banana Republic size, oh, stretch size six, Martin Fit. And gosh, looks like they dragged them across the floor. Do you see all this on there? Tell me it's just fuzz. Yes. Okay. Just fuzz. All right. Um, Martin fit in there, a little crop pant. Super cute. Filthier than all. Get out. Uh, this one is... A White House Black Market, extra small, and really super cute. And, you know, I've listed and sold quite a few of my White House Black Market. I know a lot of people say they don't really pick it up because it doesn't really sell. So far, I've been doing really good with listing mine. And, you guys, I don't list it low. I'm not trying to clearance things out. I think, I believe everything will sell. So, uh, this is a Joan, Riz Joan Rivers. It says 1X. P, but that is not petite because I am short and it is hitting the floor. So it is a maxi. I'm not going to put the P. Um, it does have pockets and it is in this hot pink scoop neck sleeveless. <laughs> you guys tell I don't like sleeves. Um, I have to start, you know, if I found them though, I guess I would buy them, but I really don't find any other kinds of styles. So anyway, this is. Um, Styling Company, a size 14, 98% cotton, pair of crop pants, great size, they are nice and white, hopefully there's nothing on them, more foot, oh no, God. look, can you see, yes, um, you know, I quickly opened up the box and I have not, because I hadn't started listing yet, gone through them, so, sometimes it's just such a drag. It's almost depressing <laughs> that you open it up. Uh, let's see. This is a Calvin Klein. It is a size 6. Um, and it is this really super cool, they call it scuba knit, um, body con, sleeveless scoop neck, starburst, ruching, uh, dress, sheath dress. So, or whatever. I think it's body con, more body con. Um, in a green, and it's like really super, that green, is, it's not showing up green there, but it's really, really pretty green. All right, only a couple more pieces left. Let's see, these are Ann Taylor Loft Marissa Trouser, and they are a size eight. And they're like in this navy, it has a little bit of, um, I don't know, spec print to it. Um, they are like a flare, so, but they're soft and comfy. And my last piece is this Emerald Sunday. This gives me total 80s vibes. Okay. And it is this sheer sleeveless scoop neck um, with this, can you see the textured, almost like a rosette lace um, bodycon bottom. So there you go. That's everything I got for you on my returns. Um, I should have another couple coming back in probably two weeks. And maybe by then they'll get my last box checked in. But if you guys have any comments, any questions or anything, you can leave them down below. I really do appreciate you watching. And until next time, guys.